Here's how you can stop making the most common mistake in Teams meetings. When sharing PowerPoint presentations, most people share their screen, open the PowerPoint presentation, then start the slideshow from there. Instead, click the Share button in the meeting and scroll down. Here you'll find PowerPoint Live and a list of your most recent presentations. Clicking any of them will open them in Teams. You can also go to the presentation. As long as you're in a meeting, a button labeled Present in Teams will appear. Click it, save the file if needed, then allow Teams to open the presentation. You've now started PowerPoint Live. You as the presenter can see the entire presentation at the bottom and decide which slide to show the others. And participants will only see the slide inside the red rectangle, nothing else. Participants can also click links in the presentation as they're watching it. While presenting, you can see if anyone raises their hand in the same window instead of having it on another screen. You can also read your speaker notes in the same window. No one else can see them. Below the image, you'll find tools such as laser pointers and pens that you can use to draw attention to parts of your presentation. Lastly, if you click the ellipsis, you can translate the entire presentation with the click of a button. This makes you look so much more professional.